it's really become probably one of the top five resources for genomics research in the world, all in two years. So uh, we're very, very happy to have this here. And it's, it's really catalyzing our research, not only within our own laboratory, but within the Toronto community. So we're focusing now to generate um, a baseline map, essentially, or a collection or catalog of all of this copy number variation data, which we house here in Toronto called the Database for Genomic Variants. The database has become the center, certainly, for all copy number variation data. This is the place that everyone comes. We're analyzing thousands of DNA samples using the latest microarray technologies to try to capture the normal variation content we see in different worldwide populations. Put that in the database and then when anyone, it could be a clinical genetics laboratory, a biotech company, an academic lab who's studying disease, finds their copy number variation content in their sample they're studying, they compare to the database to see if they find changes that may be specific to the disease. And using this approach, uh, it leads to the identification of new disease genes. The database now is being utilized several thousand times per day by different labs around the world from uh, pharmaceutical industry to biotech to clinical diagnostics. Uh, we just received 10,000 data points from Korea, for example, where we're doing the analysis. And it's really all because of the, ha having the database here.